same with scholars and families. This is another great story to share. It's called Ernest the Moose Who Doesn't Fit. And it's a great story about sometimes you don't really fit in and you have to persist and find another way. This one is by Katherine Rayner. Ernest the Moose Who Doesn't Fit. Ernest is a rather large moose. He is so large that he can't fit inside this book. Luckily, Ernest is also a very determined moose. He is not going to give up easily. He struggles to shimmy, shift, and shuffle in forward. He tries to squidge, squidge, and squeeze in backwards. Ernest's middle fits in easily, but what about the rest of him? Ernest is very disappointed. The book is just too small for him. Or is it? Ernest's little friend has a big idea. She fetches some masking tape and Ernest collects some paper. Together they carefully crinkle, crumple, and stick. They're busy for a long time. Finally they are finished. Oh, we gotta get ready here. Ernest may be a rather large moose, but now he has a rather large book. And he fits in perfectly. Oh, it's so big, it's hard to hold. He is a big moose. That's a cute little story. I hope you enjoyed that one. Remember, if you like these books, you can check them out from the library at school or from your local library. Have a great night.